What is up, YouTube? Lazy Llama here. Here we are back with some Zombital, and uh, I know the volume's off. I just kind of want to give you a little update. I just got a ton of gems. Uh, I beat one of the challenge levels up here. It was this one here. I think I got 50 gems from it, like, straight up. So what we're going to do, um, I've kind of thought this out myself, and we're not going to save up for Armory, which we could, and we're close. And again, you get a huge percent jump, which is why I was leaning towards it. But I'm going to kind of go and mix a little bit of what I was told and just kind of do my own thing here but uh we are going to go into um this get the bank upgraded and then we'll be saving for the laboratory to get the laboratory to uh four we may not get it to five which five is max uh we're done leveling these guys till uh till basically later on though but i am going to start this i don't know how long that's going to take 12 hours not too bad let's just get it going and then we're back on the grind that was just crazy just how we got that there's a boost ready for it too which um, I'll do just to skip some time. I just kind of want to give you a little update on that as well as uh, I want to show you something else as well. Go to Arcane. And I started crafting those three bricks together. And we're making this here with those three color bricks that we had from the event that obviously wouldn't be used anymore. Um, basically, it multiplies your DPS by three times and it stacks just kind of like these do. Uh, we're going to finish up the shards still. And then I'm going to start working on green shards actually as well. I did just get a green shard. Um, from doing a challenge, I believe, too. It was doing something. I think it was a challenge. But, uh, the shard, not the whole thing. The uh, splinters, I mean, sorry. So, if we get one more splinter, anyways, we'll be able to craft it into one of the bigger guys, which I don't even know if we have any of the bigger green ones. Um, but I am going to start working on getting the green ones caught up now. I mean, we got a lot of damage now because we got three of these, which is obviously it's two per each one. So, that's six. But then we got the other thing we're crafting, which would be another three. So, that's nine times damage, which is pretty good. Um, so that's pretty awesome. I don't know what that does yet. We haven't actually really gotten a chance to see what that does for us. But I've just been pushing. I'm going to be doing a reset here. I just kind of want to give you a little update and let you kind of know what's going on and where I'm spending gems and stuff. But we'll come in with some more later. I'm going to reset and uh, all of a sudden this wizard thing popped back up. Um, so I figured I'd pop back in and show this too. I know it's not full screen. I actually minimized the game a bit. And then it popped up. I don't even know if I'll have enough damage for it. But uh, yeah. It was... Uh, <laughs> A little interesting, wasn't expecting it. Um, I probably don't have enough damage, like I said, but we're going to keep mashing for this. And again, I do apologize if it's not full screen. It almost fits because it's, uh, it's like a black background, but uh, <laughs> yeah. But I was not expecting this to pop up. This is kind of out of the blue, and I happen to still have the recording software up, which is good. Otherwise, I would have had to fail on purpose. We should beat it here. Um, by the looks of things. <laughs> but I just went for to do that simple reset, and all of a sudden, like, you going to do this to me, man? Come on, we should buy as many of these as we can. Bam. You no, know, it doesn't really do anything, but... Boom, we beat the wizard, which I think technically is how you beat the kingdom. I went back to the first thing. I just make sure I got all the chests and stuff. Um, oh, there's a black orb. Oh, sick. King, yep, kingdom conquered. That's sick. Um, what does it do? Holding it. Um, that doesn't do anything. Or we don't know what it does. All right, all right. Interesting. Anyways, I'm gonna get on this. We got our first black orb. That's pretty sick. So, uh, yeah, cool. Alrighty, guys. So we're back. Um, just kind of grinding this out at this point. Uh, it's taken a while. I did just get um the king tomb to a hundred, which means I got this here. Uh, Joffrey was the best here. King's presence, which is kind of cool. Uh, and basically, it adds a hundred percent and non-tap damage. So it seems like it will do quite a bit. We're obviously going to fight this boss and just destroy it real quick with all the abilities. We are going to be ascending here in a moment. Or resetting. I don't know at this point what technically you'd want to be doing. But I technically still grinding this out and getting this up as high as level as I can rather than going into here. Probably. Oh, I feel like we're insta-killing with this now. I feel like i got to push this out now. Beat this 110 area, I guess. Oh, cool. That came easy. Um, we've been doing a lot. I did all of the earlier world. I cleaned up all the challenges I think I could do. Oh, we could do that now, I guess. Oh, no, it's just clicking only, right? Yeah, I don't know. I'm not even going to try to do that. We're not going to be able to do that, so. That's going to that's gonna chime down real quick out there. But I'm uh, pretty sure we got everything we wanted um, at this point. We can't really farm anything else. We're getting far into this. I think that's the end. But I think this was said it ended at 600, this world. So I think we've already almost got this world done, which is pretty cool. Um, so we're going to reset. I already, like I said, I already did the other world, so cleaned all the chests and stuff. So we're going to be resetting this for 21,000, which is beautiful. Um, basically puts us up pretty high. 
Uh, let's just get this started, and then um, I will go crafting things, because if you haven't noticed, it wants me to go craft things. Cool. Because uh, a couple things are done here. Go to Arcane, basically, and uh, collect this, this, and this. Oh! Level 1. Efficiency 20%. Hmm. Oh, so I can upgrade it. Efficiency. I don't know what all this is about, but okay. Nonetheless, uh, we want to be doing this shard now. Because this is, first of all, the time is going up really high. And I'll show you here in a minute. I forgot I did this. All things are, yeah, you can see it's faster there. Um, I already crafted my three into the one here, and I'm only one. O I'm one away here, so I want to do that so I can then craft the green shard. So that's the idea there, and uh, we do have the boost, which is kind of nice. So what I'm gonna do here is just really quickly. I've been trying to get on and do this throughout the day. Um, I'm just playing and whatnot. Uh, I do slack with it sometimes, but I'm just trying to get all of these done for now, or uh, at least to the point where we have 59 of them, which I didn't actually pay attention to what we're at at the moment, but that is the goal at least. We can claim those. That should be dropping pretty drastically time-wise. And then we can put these three back in here. Which you'll see these starts actually higher um, for some reason. It, that's just the way the game calculates it. It's still just the hour. So no worries on that. Uh, I actually do want to check how many things I have. We can skip it for gems. That's kind of cool that I let you do that. Uh, and back in hell, what I am going to do is I'm going to get this. Oh, sorry. They're both level three right now. That's what we did. I uh, got another three, so I am gonna actually save up for 300 for this uh, and get the laboratory done because it'll just give us another slot to craft things, and crafting things takes a while, as you can tell. So I think it'll be the best bet. We have 51 of these things, and we need 59, and then we're gonna need a ton of uh, whatever we needed to craft the pearl necklaces, which I kind of forget, but it's gonna need quite a bit nonetheless. Uh, it's gonna be a bit of a grind. Um, but that's the goal. Is I want to get in the 59, and then I'll probably start using one or, or start using one of the crafting spots to start making these into the, the things that we're talking about here, uh, and then I'll use the other one to start making more of these still because they both take an hour anyways. So yeah, let's uh let's get back in here. I already do 100. That's pretty cool. Jeez. By so many levels of this, huh? Uh, but what I've been doing is I've been pushing out uh, as far as I can in World 2 and then going to World 1. Uh, or World 2, I guess, with that, before it like starts slowing down at all or I have to start rapidly clicking too much for my, my own personal taste. Uh, and at that point, I go to World 1 and just kind of... Normally, I'd let it just AFK. Which, uh, we're not going to probably spend much time in World 1 anymore. What's this? Did I get one of those? I didn't notice. There we go. You're a god. So, we get that, which makes us so much faster, just killing. We're starting to insta-kill a lot sooner, it seems like. Uh, we also got we got the Black Orb, which is pretty cool. Um, I'm really excited to figure out what that's all about. If anything important. I'm assuming we'll find out as the game goes on. Or again, you know, you guys may end up telling me, but it's fine either way. I'm in no rush to know or not know. I really don't care either way. I mean, I do want to know, but I don't care if it's like told to me or if I find out just by playing. So let's keep going with this. Our double money is almost out, which is all right. But basically, getting 59 of the pearl, uh, the pearl necklaces will make it so this stays up for like I forget how long. Five minutes, I think, is what it was. I think is the goal, and then it, you just insta kill for a really long time. That, like when you first reset you get kind of up to a higher level like on off the go which is realistic what I'm looking for I mean that sounds like a lazy me kind of style no I don't want to activate I'm in bio skills not activate all skills all okay. right it's not a big deal once again I get to save a little bit of laziness here might as well if we're gonna go with it doesn't really matter this thing just slaughters sloths form it absolutely slaughters things. See how fast we get as fast we get back built into this. Like now we're billions, so we can come here and finish that up. Uh, and honestly, like we're just <laughs> we're already almost back up to the top. I just got to figure out what the leveling process is after you get the king to 100. 
you keep going on him or do you save up for the monolith and just start building monolith only and then I'm assuming that's the end of the game at that point because I know he's the last guy you get to so Dude, we build up orbs pretty fast though the speed of the game has been treating me pretty well I hate you can't like click down here like there's a special spot that sometimes like allows me to click underneath right underneath the circle you can if the circle's on your screen but if the circle if you don't have the circle then it's right about Bob's level I guess you could say like equally put it like his feet just so you're not clicking on all the guys because it'll actually lower your DPS a lot or like your clicks you're clicking a lot if you're clicking on the guys running by so something that you guys kind of taught me when it, as far as that goes but this is generally where I'd get I'd get to this point about 300 and then I'd start getting a couple levels of the flying squid and it, I'd start buying the levels really slow. Like you wouldn't be able to get many at a time. So that's when I would go over and just let it insta kind of kill on the other side of the spectrum. But uh, again, I'll do that off camera. Just let it kind of grind up. We're going to push this as far as we can. In world. I've never actually tried to push it like this. So what is this for? What was the effect? Uh, crafting takes forever. Getting off those 300 gems is going to take forever as well, which I'm not really looking forward to saving that up, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. It does take a long time to start saving up gems, though. We're starting to get a lot of orbs. I mean, we're going to be breaking 200,000 orbs, you know, next reset. Like, it's beautiful. That's awesome. It's kind of crazy to think about, to be honest. Like, we just broke 100,000. <laughs> Two hundred thousand. We're gonna be we're gonna be spiraling out of control. I feel like soon we're getting to the point of the game where things just speed up. It's like transcending in Clicker Heroes. You get to this point, you get to a point of the game, and just you know you take off like hard to slow you down kind of thing. All right, so we can level this up and grab flying squid. It really didn't make a difference because we kill so fast anyways. But getting all these orbs and like non rares and stuff is great. I'll speed up the process a ton, but I mean, look how fast we're already getting to 400. Like, we're already at, you know, 350 with zero struggle. But, we do a ton of DPS, um, for that other, the other skill. We could have pushed that out a bit farther, but, before we ascended, or, I don't know what you want to call it, time, time travel? It's time traveling. I feel like I always get confused on what I should call it, be calling it. Pop those other two abilities because it was slowing down a slight bit. Should fly past that 400. Oh wow! Could have already afforded to level him. And now we start buying levels of the king. Which again, I, I'm not really sure how I should go upon that. I mean, he's going to be doing the top damage. Um, and I was told that you want to be getting his uh, items as far as like items go. Like the items. It's going to be getting his, like the second tier of him and whatnot. Like Because they're like, well, they got the stars on him. And to save up a ton of those is good just to get the extra DPS. Because he's definitely your main DPS at the end of the game. It's just, do I level this up? I mean... Multiply all DPS by three for each level. I mean, that, that's pretty crazy. Um, to be honest, that is a lot. If we didn't have that, I mean, we wouldn't be able to push as far as we do. Because this adds quite a, that adds quite a bit. That's a lot of money to sit by another level of that. We were at 100Q. Um, without Q, not Q2. We were just at 100Q. So we had to get 10 times, basically, what we had to afford that. I mean... If I waited overnight, I probably could have grabbed it in the morning or whatever, but. It's 50 trillion taking a while. How'd I get that 50 trillion? Oh, I was at the higher levels, huh? Yeah, we're starting to get there now, actually. Damage just jumps up. I uh, actually didn't really jump up much, huh? One level of him does, like, nothing. Thought it did more than that. Actually, if you technically think about it, it's still more efficient to be leveling up squid if you need that extra damage. So it looks like it's adding 41 S2, and this only adds 2 S2. 
And now they're equal price actually. So that's 52 or that. I mean, obviously I'm going to go with this because I'm insta-killing anyways. But technically speaking, Flying Squid is better to get up a couple more levels at least. I don't know how high you'd want to go with it. But we're starting to get to the point where, like I said, where we can do these runs relatively fast. I mean, we beat, beat this 400. So now we're going to the 431. Uh, what we can do real quick while we're kind of grinding this out. Let's go for this. This is one of the star two chests that have like all well, two things. This is what I was talking about, uh, and I've been getting the red lipsticks. I think that's used to craft something that I needed. I relatively remember needing that, and I don't think I needed these other things for any of the big crafts. I don't think that was used for the pearl. I'm not too concerned about it now because I'm not crafting them. But it was. Yeah, I don't think it was that. Then we can do this one later on, which I doubt we can do now, right? Yeah. No, we ain't doing that. We ain't doing it. I get it. I get it. I don't know where I was, though. Here? Yeah. Cool. But, uh, anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I'm going to keep this grinding. Um, we'll be doing more pushing as time goes on. But, uh, anyways, guys, hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If so, please smack the like button. It really does show the support to me and the series. And, as always, I will catch you in the next one. Peace.